Okay, for this question, I'm going to use difference unchanged concept. Okay, so why is it difference unchanged concept? Because of the keyword or the phrase give away equal number of rubber band to their friend Tola. Okay, so you know that if your change is equal, then you will apply the difference unchanged concept. So difference unchanged concept is when the change is equal. In this case, the change is equal. All right. So as usual, uh, difference unchanged, all unchanged concept, you must identify the before, the change and the after. Let's identify these three things. Okay, Inez and Cho had some rubber bands in the ratio of 10 is to 9. This is Inez, this is Cho. And definitely, this is my before information. All right. After they gave away an equal number of rubber band, the gave away tells me that this is my change. My change is equal to the friend Tola. Cho, the comma, tell us that this is what happens next after the change is my after okay so cho had three over five as many rubber bands as Ines. this is unit this is unit this is cho this is Ines. what fraction of her rubber band did Ines give to tola okay which means i want to know the given over Ines. This is what I want to find. The given over Ines number of rubber band. Okay. Do I have my before? Yes. I have my change. I have my after. All I have already. What do I do next? Draw out my box. Okay. I'm going to draw a longer one. Divide it into three columns. One, two, three. Why three? Because there's a difference column at the side. So Ines so difference, I put short form, before, change, after, before, change, after, okay? Now, we put in all the information that we already highlighted in the question. Before Ines, before Ines, 10. 10 what? 10 units because ratio is in its units form. Before Cho, 9 units, okay? Give away means minus, minus, but I do not know. It's a question mark. It's a question mark. I do not know. But I know that these two are equal. Okay? Then after. After, so will be three units. So you put there three units. After, Ines is five units. So you put there five units. Difference means you need to minus. What do I look at? The before and after row. So the difference for before will be 10 unit minus 9 unit equals to 1 unit. For the after, 5 unit minus 3 unit equals to 2 units. Now, this difference and this difference. The before and after for difference unchanged concept, the before and after units must be the same. You look at that thing, you know that this is not the same. So make it the same first. All right. So how do we do that? I times two here. If I times two there, then the whole row of before must times two. Must times two. Here becomes 20 units. Here becomes 18 units. Here becomes two units. So when I check, two units is equal to two units. So, it is already equal already. So, okay. Now, let's move back to find the question mark here. Okay, I want Ines, right? So, just look at Ines. Look at Ines. So, I want to find Ines given away. This one. Okay. So, I raise the, I raise the question mark. All I have to do is I need to look at the before and after information. So, the before, if you can see the before, I have 20 units. After she gave away something, it becomes 5 units. 
right? So how much did she give away? What must you do? Before and after, you need to minus. Okay? So you need to minus 20 units minus 5 units. You will get 15 units. Okay? So to double check, just to double check for the cho, let's check whether it's the same. 18 units minus 3 units equals to 15 units. So we are on the right track. We are on right. Okay? So we know that the given... The given is 15 units and Ines have a total of 20 units at first, right? Ines, Ines is 20 units. So it's 15 over 20. Then when you divide by 5, divide by 5, you get 3 out of 4. That is the answer. Okay?